Washington, Indiana City Council approved an annexation ordinance adding more than 1,000 acres of land to its borders. And News 10's Mike Grant reports the move is part of a plan to help the community maximize its potential growth. After only three years of work, construction crews are busy putting the finishing touches on I-69 east of Washington to open the highway next week. The work on the highway has prompted a flurry of activity by the city of Washington. It includes a 1,200-acre annexation of land surrounding the road. We want to make sure that to the east side, which is going to be the new front door to the city of Washington, uh, develops in, an, in as orderly way as possible. Uh, it's really a win-win, and that brings more resources to the table to get some of this infrastructure in place. To some folks, a new interstate is just a road, but that's not the case here. They see it as an opportunity to attract new industry and jobs, so they've been doing a lot of work trying to get ready for this highway to open. We think we're well positioned, uh, but we will need to do some improvements to make sure we can capitalize on all the growth that happens. So while the crews try to wind down their work on the highway, this community is laying plans to add more utilities into the area to make it even more attractive to developers. We've started planning this thing. I think we're further along than some. I wouldn't say we're the furthest along, but we've done our fair share of work and we'll continue to do so. Something that means that more construction and development will be coming to this community's new front door after the road crews have moved on. In Washington, I'm Mike Grant, News 10. The Indiana Department of Transportation plans to open the 66-mile section of I-69 that runs from Crane to Evansville on Monday.